today we're going to be looking at measuring curved line distance. So sometimes we need to measure the length of a road, a river or a railway line on our OS map. They tend to be quite irregular. And so we need to do what's called a curved line distance. So measuring from one point to another, like we would with a straight point distance, will not work. So we use what we call it as a curve line distance. So on the example in front of me here, I've got my OS map of Waterford, and I'm going to measure the curve line distance of the N24, which starts just over here and ends here at the roundabout. But as you can see, there's plenty of bends on it, like most roads. And so we need to find our way around it. So you start by getting the edge of a strip of paper or the edge of your copy. Either of them is going to work perfectly fine. And you line up one side of the paper with the end of the road. So you can see the end of the road is just up here. And you make a little mark on your page. What you do then is you line it up until you can find the first bend. And at that first bend, you draw a little mark. From there, drop your pen and twist your edge of the paper around until you meet the next corner on the road, which will be here. You twist it again to here and you keep going around. And you're going to do this all the way until you get to the point at the end of the distance that you are supposed to be measuring. And the N24, as I said, it ends right up here at the roundabout. And so I'll leave a mark there. So now you've got the curved line distance, but in a way that you can take your ruler and you can measure it. So in centimeters from one end to the other is approximately 10.5 centimeters. We then need to convert this into kilometers because obviously it's a road. So what you do is you flip over your OS map, you'll have a legend on the back, and along the bottom here, you will have a converter. So it will convert your centimeters into kilometers. So if we line it up here with our zero kilometers and go all the way up to the end, it works out at approximately 5.25 kilometers. So we can say that the curve line distance of the N24 is 5.25 kilometers.